For two years now, I've been digging up all the geeky data inside the Model 3, and I've come up with a bunch of prototypes for ways to watch that data as you drive. This is something I've wanted to do since before I even got the car, um, and I've always been interested in all the various signals and electronics and what they're doing as they drive around in this wonderful car. Over the past year or so, you've seen a couple of the prototypes that I've experimented with, but finally, I have something that's good enough, not only for me, but for everyone else. And here it is. I'm calling this the micro display. It's completely wireless, except for the USB power, and you can put it wherever you want. It can show thousands of signals from within your car. Simple things like motor power, uh, or a more visible speedometer. Uh, more unusual items like coolant temperatures, autopilot status, even blind spot monitoring. This was specifically designed to be small enough to hide away in the Model 3 and the Model Y air vents. However, the numbers are still big enough to make them very easy to read. The small size allows you to mount it anywhere you want. The bottom of the windshield, for example, close to your angle of view, over the steering wheel, whatever you'd like. So it's actually a system of several modular products that you plug together to make whatever display you want. You can have multiple displays as well as bar graphs to make meters and watch several things at once. And because these are Wi-Fi based, that means they're safer too. You're not running dangerous uh, network wires around your car and your dashboard. You're not going to screw anything up here. In addition to the displays, the base of the system is called the CAN server. The server connects to the network and sends the data to several displays in the car. In fact, you can have multiple servers plugged into multiple networks if you wanted to see data all over the car. In fact, the CAN server is a product of its own with tons of possibilities. While the ultimate goal is for anyone to pick this up and use it, maybe configure it with their phone, the server is an ESP32 that's Arduino compatible and you can program it to do whatever you'd like. The server software is available on GitHub for the community to add all sorts of features. The CAN server can potentially do tons of things with all the data that it's seeing on the networks that it's connected to. It's got uh, built-in SD card slot, so it could log data straight to that SD card at high speed or maybe slow speed for your whole drive. It has built-in Wi-Fi and Bluetooth, so maybe when you get home it can connect to the cloud and upload that data, uh, as well as connect to the many phone apps that are out there but at full Wi-Fi speed, much faster than the Bluetooth dongles that they currently use. The CAN server plugs in either under the seat into the chassis bus, which this has dedicated connectors for, uh, or there's an ODB version, which plugs into the to typical harness that people are getting right now. Uh, and I, in other cars that have ODB built in, it'll plug into that as well. So the system's designed to be plug and play for those who just want displays and want it to be as simple as possible and super powerful and flexible for power users who can imagine doing so much more with it. So I made these products for me, but now I can make them for everyone else. So check my website at the link below for more information. And I want to give a shout out to the Tesla community who helped make this all possible. There's so many great people out there who are not only super smart, but willing to jump in and help out. From the early days of reverse engineering the CAN buses and the signals on them, to making spectacular free computer and phone apps to analyze those signals. And now the community can help make this product even better. To me, it's all proof that things are much better when people put their minds together. So check it out and thanks.